Wow, Diddle, you sure have been posting a lot of Steam videos lately. I wonder why that is. I wonder why you're posting so many Steam videos right in a row like that. Diddle, why, why, why I wonder why you're doing that. Diddle. Creating original content is really hard, especially when you're as inconsistent as I am. Steam videos are really all I have to bring to the table right now, guys. What a great life I live, right? If you guys really, really want to know why I've been posting so many Steam videos lately, uh, let me tell you. Right after a word from our sponsor. Money! He got money! Get it all for him! This video is sponsored by DMarket. DMarket is a blockchain-based trading service that allows you to trade commission-free from game to game. No transaction fees is a big deal because some other sites take like 5 or 10% and that's a big pain in the ass when you're trying to make profit. Right now they only offer a few games as well as some specific DMarket blockchain items. However, in the future they are planning on adding a lot more games and they do have a lot of pretty big partners. So there's definitely a lot of room for expansion in the future. And honestly guys, with the state of how Steam is treating trades right now, it's really kind of a good idea to get your skins into a decentralized area. That way if you are trade banned or if Valve disables trades altogether, your skins are still in a decentralized place where you can still access them and you can still cash them out if you need to. Filling your balance is pretty easy. All you have to do is click on your name, go to balance, and hit deposit on whichever currency you want to put in. Deposit USD, you can go directly through PayPal and have it in seconds. And DMarket also has their own dedicated currency so you can use that as well. Once your funds are added, you simply click on the game that you're interested in and you can just buy everything that you want. Anyway, Anyways guys, with everything that's going on with Steam, the blockchain based trading platforms are definitely something that are going to be on the rise in the next year or so, and I really think that this is something worth checking out. It's a great way to secure your skins, and they also have an app so you can keep track of your wallet on the go. In the description guys, I have a link that will take you directly to the site, and I definitely recommend at least checking it out. If not for the blockchain aspect of things, then for the commission free trading, because that really is a big deal. Anyways, that's enough about that. I hope you guys enjoy this mediocre content I'm about to put out for you, and you guys have a great day. Ooh, that was a lot of selling out, bro. The Lamborghini Huracan that I got purchased for me from the last sponsored plug uh, actually had a timing belt issue So now I have to sell out again to pay for that timing belt for the Lamborghini Huracan that I was given That's it. That's what it is. Anyways guys the nudity tag bro Today we're gonna be looking at the nudity tag on Steam And we're gonna be seeing what Steam can actually get away with when it comes to not safe for work content My name is Susan Boyle. You're watching the Disney Channel, and this is Random Games on Steam the demonetized edition. I am really fucking bad at reverb. So the first game we're gonna be checking out today is called Panty Party. And honestly, I'm not down with this whole weeaboo furry My Little Pony bullshit. So I'm really not excited about this. But hell man, I love me some panties. I know a lot of you guys love some panties and I sure love me that ad revenue. So we're gonna check this out. Also, it's from a developer called Animu Games. So how serious can it be? So before I start this, while we have the wonderful Panty Party theme music in the background, I just wanna let you guys know it is extremely Hard. find a good game with nudity that isn't some weird Japanese game I don't know what it is with the Japanese game creators on Steam, but they really really love their fat anime titties, bro I don't know why anyways guys Steam also has a category just for anime So if this video can get to 5,000 likes in the first 10 seconds of it being posted I will make a video on the anime category on Steam. I won't enjoy it I don't want to do it. It's a waste of money, but I'll do it for the ad revenue I mean for for you guys. I'll do it for you guys if you want to see that let me know so Panty Party has an arcade mode and a story mode. Obviously, we're really interested in that enticing panty story. So we're going to start this right here. It looks like we can choose our panties and we have attack speed. Is that a duck? Is that a fucking duck? Anyways, my, my panties have attacking abilities, apparently. So let, let's just hop into this. Oh, Jesus Christ. I have to find the warrior of love. What is going? Is this a dating simulator or is this a fighting game? What is this? A panty fell on the train track. The train has been delayed. Over some panties? Shit, bro, she must have some bomb ass. Listen. FBI, open up! What the fuck is going on? I can attack. I have a little panty sword, bro. Is that a panty boomerang? What? My stupid ass got a panty boomerang, bro. And I got this little bow on and shit. Oh my god. The Japanese make the best games, bro. Is that pooping? If I when I hit this, does that take a dump? What the hell is that? Fuck it, bro. Mask off. We're about to get get this panty combo. When an enemy is down, you can't damage him. This is literally like an old Sonic game, except it's underwear instead of Sonic. Why can I fly? 
I'm able to jump like nine times. My passion meter is full. What does passion do? So I'm in passion mode right now. Now they feel the love? What the hell is going on? This is literally a Sonic game. This is lit like you gotta go fast, bro. You are really powerful, worthy of a warrior of love. Are you fucking kidding me? Wait a minute, so is this girl turning into panties? Is that what's going on? Is that what's happening here? She's turning into panties and I'm helping her fight? The lovely young me is back. What is wrong with Japan? This girl is like 13 and they got her turning into a pair of underwear that I'm using to beat up. I'm not even beating up underwear. I'm beating up young girls with underwear. What the fuck is this? All right, let's do one more level. That's all I got mentally. Like that's all I can take. We're in the park now. I can jump 12 times. Looks like there's other flying panties. It's a panty party here, bro. Jesus Christ. Just take out all the panties, bro. Just all the pan- all the panties. Just goodbye. Not today, white panties. I'm about to turn you into green panties. That was gross. That was a gross thing I just said. These are- these are panties. They literally just like fly out. Oh, look at- we got dot panty now, bro. We unlocked a new kind of panty enemy. All right, we got it. We got it. I unlocked a new kind of panty, bro. You bet I am never ever playing with that. Goodbye, all F4. I'm turning off my fucking computer. Good night. Now we got hentai puzzle. What could go wrong? <laughs> I'm gonna let you guys know right now, I'm not gonna do like the traditional like review kind of thing for these videos. Like I, I can't, like I'm not down with this whole anime shit, I just can't do it. I really cannot. So hentai puzzle looks like it's just a fucking, this is it, it's just like a sliding puzzle game. I'm about to create something that looks vaguely like a butt cheek, that's the whole point of this. Let's see how fast I can solve this hentai puzzle right now. Wow, look at that. There's 10 whole seconds in this video where you guys could actually subscribe to the channel. Also, guys, I have a Discord server, so if you guys want to check that out, it'll be in the description. Thanks. Oh, I did it! I did it! Oh my god! Holy shit, that took far too long, bro. Holy shit. All right, so right off the bat, level two is bare boobs. So ne next game, we're not we're not doing that. <laughs> I'd like to have a chance to stay monetized if I can. That'd be nice. All right, now, now that we're done with the anime games, we're going to be moving to the next genre. And uh, most... Jesus! No, shit! I think this game is just meant to be an achievement game because I've gotten 21 achievements for literally doing nothing and it doesn't explain any controls and this game is just a big meme. Anyways, we're moving out of the genre of anime games and into games that just do not function. I don't know what's going on right now. I can just kind of fly. I think I'm out of the map now. Yep, I'm out of the map. I don't know what happened here. This could have gone much, much better. So this next game is a true American classic with a wonderful, wonderful aspect ratio. This is Shower With Your Dad Simulator 2015. Do you still shower with your dad? Now my instant favorite part about this game is that if you go into the settings and try and change the nudity option, you're met with the option for yeah, yes, dong, and hell yeah. There's no there's no way to turn off nudity, so I, I'm interested to see what this is gonna be like. Also, for some reason we can change the field of view from 90 to 90.1, and that's all we got, so. All right, so it looks like we pick our dad here. We can be Thomas and Magnum, Richard and Lefty, or Johnny and Robin. Now realistically, I should probably pick the one that's most relevant relevant to my life. So I'm gonna go with Richard and Lefty. We're gonna lather up here and let's see what's going on. It looks like all we gotta do is just find the right shower with our pop. And uh, you know, if we do that, we will never be in the wrong. Just gotta get to the shower with my dad. What happens if we go to the wrong shower? I don't really wanna know. I'm pretty good at this. That's all I'm gonna say. I'm really good at showering with my dad in 2015. Look at this. Look at how good I am, bro. Oh, it looks like we got some cautions now. Does it? Ah, I showered with a ginger dad. Oh my God. Is that really all this game has to offer though? Though, like actually is this it is this the whole game you just run and shower with your your slightly tan naked dad with a pixel penis this is a great time boys i this is what makes life worth living honestly i'm about to set a world record for this game bro i got a 50 dad streak right now i'm not slowing down oh i slipped on a puddle oh i slipped on a puddle skirt skirt oh shit i'm on a 50 five dad streak right now bro we're going for it we're gonna shower with all the dads 64 was my consecutive dad streak bro let's try out some of the other game modes this game's actually pretty lit now i gotta grab the appropriated dad to my race what is going on this is like pokemon but for dads bro you just gotta catch them all all right i think that's i think that's enough showering with my father for a little bit so guys that's gonna do it for this video i hope you enjoyed i hope this video doesn't get demonetized even if it does your boy got a sponsor so it's fine anyways guys that's gonna do 
it for your quality American content today. I would like to thank you guys personally for 100,000 subscribers. This has been something crazy that I've been working towards since I was like 14, and now I'm almost 20, so it's insane that we've actually been able to reach this milestone, and I'm super excited about the future. I have a ton of new video ideas coming really, really soon. They're in the works now. I'm just waiting on some stuff to come in the mail, and then I'll have those done for you guys. I have some stuff for 100k planned as well. You'll see that in the next few weeks. Anyways, guys, like I said, thank you so much for sticking around with me. I really appreciate it. Once again, if this video gets to 5,000 likes in the first one second of it being uploaded, I will make a video dedicated just to the anime games, and I'll tell you what, guys, I'll even give you a bonus game. I'll do five games in one video. Five anime games. I can't even handle one anime game, and I'll do five of them for you guys. Let me know what you think. Anyways, guys, have a great day. I hope you enjoyed the video, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.